Hey everybody, it's a Mayhem Minute. It's Monday! It's the day after WWE Fast Lane. It's a Fast Lane pay-per-view hangover going on right now. And, uh, you know, a lot of thoughts floating around out there about, well, what kind of show is this? What has this set up for WrestleMania? And let's be honest, if you didn't know what this was going to set up for WrestleMania, I feel like you haven't been paying attention if you're a follower of the sheets and you're a follower of this. You know, there's no real surprises coming out of Fastlane, I don't think. You know, we are ending up with Roman Reigns versus Brock Lesnar. We are ending up with Sting versus Triple H. If you haven't seen the writing of the walls, we saw a preview of, uh, Taker and Bray Wyatt pretty much gonna happen at this point, right? Um, you know, and uh, as far as Fastlane itself, I feel like it was a rough show. I feel like uh, even though there was a lot of matches that I think had shouldn't have been so flat, I don't know if it's partially the crowd. Crowd seemed very dead until the high spots uh, later in the show with like you know Brian and. Brian and uh, uh, Reigns, for instance, uh, Cena, Cena, Rusev, um, which I think were both tremendous, tremendous matches. We did have a lot of talking. We had the Bray Wyatt Undertaker segment. We had the Triple H Sting, Sting segment. Um, so, uh, you know, I think that kind of flattens your 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 pay per view. Um, and it, I think it does reason, you know, oh, hey, most of you got it free. Well, you know, uh, some of us have been, uh, you know, it's, it's the, the birthday starting today of the WWE Network. And for those that have been on board since the birthday of the WWE Network, which actually shouldn't be today because it was Monday last year. Maybe, I don't know. Calendars. Um, you know, a little rough. You know, eh, it's 999. At least we got takeover this month, right? Um, and... Uh, if you're a person that pays sixty dollars for these things, I'm sorry. I am so sorry. As a big throwing money out the window at this point, unfortunately. Um, unless you're a really, really big fan of WWE and what they do here, which I don't think there's a lot of people. I mean, there's a lot of people, but I think there's not the significant number that should be at that point. Anyways, uh, beyond the thing of that. Um, but no, Fastlane uh, was very interesting. Um, we got a lot of setup. We got a lot of funky endings. We we're saying at the beginning of the night, myself and Matt Carlin's uh, mainstream Matt with one T on the Twitter. Um, you know, this is a night that there should be no clean finishes. And save for the main event, I don't think there were. And, you know, as far as significant matches. And even you look at uh, Roman Reigns and Daniel Bryan, I think it served his job. Yeah, Daniel Bryan could still get kind of thrown in the three way. I mean, let's be honest, they can find some way for that to happen or just to screw with Roman, right? But it made Roman Reigns look strong. No, it, but no, I think it really was, uh, you know, Roman had a chip on his shoulder, especially after what was going on at Royal Rumble, especially after everything else. And I think Roman Reigns stepped up. You can say, you know, how much of that was Daniel Bryan? No, I think well, I think Daniel Bryan pushed him for sure. Um, but I think a lot of that was Roman. Um, there's certain things I think in there where... Maybe Daniel Bryan's like, hey, do this. But Daniel or Roman Reigns executed, you know, uh, regardless of who was in the ring across from him. Um, and I thought it was a tremendous, tremendous match worthy of a main event. Think about that. Roman Reigns and Daniel Bryan was in a main event over John Cena. CM Punk didn't even get that that much when he had the title. Think about that. So let me know your thoughts on Fastlane. Let me know on these uh, comments on Twitter, on these comments on YouTube if you're watching on there or on Facebook. Um, and also let us know at Mayhem Show on Twitter. And we'll be talking about this so much more. We have the Raw wrap up Monday night directly after Raw. Follow our Twitter for in our Google Plus page for links to that. We do it live on Google Hangout. We also will be doing the Wrestling Mayhem Show 9 p.m. Tuesday night, Eastern Time, um, with uh, the, 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 check out our latest in the Mayhem Mania. If you want to see how the Mayhem Mania has been doing on the YouTube channel, just look for the Mayhem Mania. A little search on that page will be fine. And also mainstreammat.blogspot.com for uh, the latest. What have we done to the WrestleMania card in our wonderful thought experiment? In the Mayhem Show guest this week is VIP Joe Rosa will be joining us. He's a current trainer down at IWC Wrestling here in Pittsburgh and uh, has been... Uh, uh, making a been a face of change you could say so we'll talk about a bit of that as well until next time uh, wrestling rawr
This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.